Hey guys, welcome to my channel F1 Sports Cards. My name's Glenn, and in this video, I'm going to tell you how you can meet up with me this weekend and get some free F1 Sports Cards. Let's get right into it. Before we get into today's video, I just want to say a huge thank you to everybody that smashes up the like button as always, and to all the new subscribers, welcome to my channel. If you like collecting sports cards, and F1 cards in particular, this is the place to be, so make sure you click subscribe. You can also follow me on my social medias, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, and the Facebook group, which has over 4,000 members now, under the name F1 Sports Cards. If you want to buy any single cards to complete your sets at home, you can check out my website, www.f1sportcards.com. Right, let's get into today's topic. I am going to be at CardCon 2 this weekend. If you've watched my content in the past, you'll know that I went to CardCon. I've been to the many other card shows in and around the UK, but I've chose this one as being my very first card show that I'm going to go to as a vendor. So I'm going to have a table there. I've tried to shy away from this in the past because I always saw it as not my sort of thing. But my main goal, obviously we're going to sell some F1 cards to people that are interested in collecting F1 cards. But my main goal and my main passion for this weekend is to meet as many of you guys as possible. Just recently, I went to the special exclusive Tops event that they organise at the Silverstone Museum. And I was actually sitting on a table with sort of 10 other people. And it weren't until after the show had finished that I discovered that there were several people around that table that regularly take part in my whatnots, that regularly buy stuff from my website, and regularly watch these videos and comment. But we didn't, I didn't approach them, they didn't approach me, they never told me who they were, you know. So we never actually spoke, which I just find crazy. So what I... I'm hoping with this, me being available all weekend at Farnsborough for CardCon 2, is that it gives you guys a chance to come and say hello to me, and my son Tyler's going to be there as well. We're going to have some F1 cards, and we can just stop and talk about the hobby, collectible cards, whatnot, whatever it is you want to discuss, feel free to approach me. I will also be staying at the Aviator Hotel, which is across the road from the venue. So I'm going to be staying as close to the venue as possible. So if you want to meet up after the show's finished, I will be available for a couple of beers or even a meal. <laughs> so let's have a little look at what's going on this weekend, other than obviously me being there. Let's have a little look at what CardCon has to offer. So this is their official website. If you're watching this video, I've left this really last minute, I know. It's going live in one day and 16 hours, so in two days. Not tomorrow, but Saturday morning. The doors are going to open for VIP pass holders first. They're going to get in at 9 a.m. They're going to have one hour to walk around and check out all the sport and TCG cards that they want first. And then the general admission is going to be at 10 a.m. Now, I'm going to be sitting there setting up as a vendor from 8 a.m. So I'll be there ready to go from when you guys first enter the building. You can come and find me obviously over at the desk. I don't know where the desk is in comparison to where everything else is, but you'll see my banners and my uh, displays, F1 sports cards. I'm going to be there this weekend all day. The event goes on 10 till 5 on the Saturday and 10 till 4 on the Sunday. On the Saturday after the show has finished... There's going to be a trade night. So that is for people that want to stay and maybe not sell cards, but maybe just trade them with other vendors and other collect collectors. That will be at the entrance of the main hall. So we haven't got to move very far and there's going to be a trade night. And then, like I say, I'm going to be available all weekend if people want to go out for a meal, go out for a beer, have a chat and talk about all things in the hobby. General admission is $10.99. We've got the VIP passes for $29.99. And then there's um, a ticket children under the age of 16 getting free. I think you still have to book them a ticket, but it won't cost you anything to bring any of the kids as well. So that's great news. Uh, we've also got... 
uh, loads of sponsors going here. We've got Golden. So if you've ever seen the um, Netflix series, the Collectors series, uh, Golden are going to be there. Tops are going to be there. So if you have ever thought, oh, I wish I could speak to Tops and say, I wish you did this, or how comes you've done they're going to be there available to talk to. Leaf Trading Cards. I'm very interested to talk to Leaf because they actually do have some F1 autograph cards. But I don't know what sets they're in or how you get them. So I'm going to actually approach them and see how well their knowledge is for F1 cards. Um, they also have eBay, Whatnot, Alt, Heritage Auctions, Dave and Adams from Europe. So Dave and Adams is a huge distributor in America and they've just branched out and they're trying to break into Europe and they're actually coming from the Netherlands over to this show to promote obviously the Dave and Adams store in Europe. Comp C are going to be there, PWCC, CGC cards are going to be there. They grade like comic books and cards and stuff like that. Uh, I know they do a lot of Pokemon stuff. Uh, mascot. Uh, they also have MGC. MGC is like the UK's sort of premium grading service there. And they're going to be grading live at the venue. So if you want, you can don't like the idea of shipping your cards to America and stuff like that. And you want to get them graded. You want to get them protected. MGC are going to be there to grade them there and then. Third down, that's where I get all my little uh, stands from. They're going to be there. So there's going to be like everyone who's in the hobby in the UK and obviously Europe are going to be there. So it's going to be re a real interesting event. If you're into the card hobby and into sports cards in general, this is going to be the place that you want to attend. Uh, and like I say, obviously, you want to meet moi. <laughs> and like I say, if you want to meet up for a drink or a beer after the venue, make sure you drop me a message on Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, Facebook, all with the name F1 Sports Cards. Please get in contact with me and let me know if you're going to be there. If you approach me and say the word slipstream... I will give you a free pack of cards. I don't know what yet, but I will give you a free pack of cards if you come up to me and say the word slipstream because then we have a code that I know and you know that you've watched this video and hopefully you're a subscriber of this channel. Uh, but that's it. I'm going to be there as well. I'll probably do some live breaks while we're there on whatnot. So uh, I know that Pav from F1 Cards is going to be there. Bart from... Uh, Bart Sports Cards is going to be there as well. So hopefully I'll get to meet up and chat with those guys. So hopefully we can do a joint break or something. I haven't actually spoke to them about that. So <laughs> Sorry if I've just bombarded that on you guys. Uh, but hopefully we can do like a big joint F1 uh, stream. That would be really cool. So make sure you join me for this event this weekend at Farnsborough. It's 35 minutes away from Waterloo in London. There's loads of hotels dotted around the conference centre. It's a massive airfield. It's huge. You can't miss it. Huge car park as well. So you can drive there and park up safely. And uh, I look forward to hopefully seeing many of you this weekend. I'm really excited about it. That's it from me, guys. I hope you've liked that. I'll hopefully see you this weekend. Peace.